In this video, I am going to be telling you all you need to know about Google's new feature that they introduced into the Google Assistant app on your mobile phone. So sit back, relax, let's figure this out. Hello guys, and welcome to the Africa Mix channel. On this channel, we take the big Hollywood ideas and we transpose them into smaller ideas so that you, the indie filmmaker across any part of the world, can implement in your works. Today, we are talking about something very awesome. In fact, this thing blew my mind. I just couldn't wait to share this awesome feature that was actually introduced by Google onto the Google Assistant app because I figured out that most people don't know of this new update. And so that is why we are making this video today to explore what actually you can use this app for because this particular feature has a tendency of benefiting filmmakers, especially when it comes to sound or sound effects or not just filmmakers, but even if you're a YouTuber, this video is rightly for you. Make sure to watch it till the end or if you're interested in filmmaking of any sort because sound is actually 70% of your film. So it's a very important topic. So anything that has to do with sound, it gets me so much very excited. Let's get straight into the topic. But before we do guys, if you're new to the channel, I would much appreciate it if you click on the subscribe button and hit on the notification icon so that you get notified anytime we drop awesome content like this on this channel. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for being there for the Africa Amaze channel. Now, let's get right into it. Google in October of 2020, made a very important upgrade to the Assistant app or what you call the Google Assistant app on your mobile phone, which I call the Ham to Find Song feature. So how does this feature work? Now, all you do is if you know a song, but you don't know the artist or you don't know anything else of the song, all you can do is just to ham. So for example, probably if there's a song and all you can do is maybe, mm, 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 mm. yeah, just something, maybe just having the rhythm of the song. What you can simply do is you can just click on the Google app and just hum the song and miraculously the song would appear. For those of you who are used to Shazam and other apps that you listen to the music and you know just press the phone to listen to it, this works a little bit different. This is just humming. So all you need is just the melody or the rhythm of the song. So you just need to hum it and it will find it for you. And as a filmmaker, Imagine the whole new world of possibilities that this brings to you. For example, you watch a YouTube video or you watch a film or you watch a movie and you hear the sound that you actually want to recreate or you want to actually know who created that particular music or who created that particular song. So all you need to do is just to learn the rhythm of that particular soundtrack and just pick up your phone, click on your Google icon and just ham the music into the phone and lo and behold, it is going to provide the author or the person who owns the copyright to the music. And if you can use it for free or whatsoever reason, or if it is just a song that you want to download for fun. Guys, this is so mind blowing. And I feel like 2020, it's really a very great year. So enough of the talking, let me get you onto the tech table and let's put this into practice. Let me show you actually how it's done. Guys, at this point of the video, if you haven't clicked on the like button, I will much appreciate it if you click on the like button so we move to the next stage. So without much ado, let's get onto the tech table and I will show you exactly how this app works. Okay, so let's bring in our phone and let's put this to the test and see how it actually works. So it works basically just like your normal Google services. So for example, let's click on our mic button and after clicking this what you do is that you first of all say what is the song or what is this song then you now go ahead then start to hum the song but guys be very careful like i said you might look very stupid at times if someone is listening to you so just be very careful with that but let's put it to the test so i'm going to try this with a dikenzo song which is titled Sita Lowe's. So I'm going to search for Sita Lowe's. I know the rhythm of Sita Lowe's. So what I do is I first of all click on the mic icon and tell it or ask it what's this song. Then it begins to listen. Then you go ahead to sing the melody or the rhythm of the song. So let's try this out. What's this song? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
And there you go. That is Sita Lowe's for you. Exactly the song I was actually humming. Guys, isn't this amazing? Now let's go ahead to try, let's say, um, a song from um, any artist here in Ghana. Probably, let me search for Kwame Yuji's song. Kwame Yuji is actually an artist based here in Ghana. Let's try this. What's this song? And there you go. Wish me well by Kwame Yuji. And this is exactly the song I was humming, guys. And anyone from Ghana who knows this artist will tell you this is exactly the song I was humming. Guys, isn't this amazing? It can go on and on and on and on. So guys, that is all for this video. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below on how you will be using the software or what exactly you are going to be using this particular update on your Google Assistant for. It's with me, OBL Junior here, right here on the African Miss channel. Guys, if you have any further questions, you can DM me on Instagram at OBL underscore Junior. And guys, sorry for bringing you a midweek video because from now onwards, that is going to be the case. Anytime there is something awesome or any new tech pops up that has a tendency of impacting whether negatively or positively on us as filmmakers, we wouldn't hesitate to post a video on it when it is Wednesday or midweek before our regular posting days, which are Fridays and Mondays. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel, kindly do so because we have much more awesome content coming up soon. Thank you so much, guys, for watching, and I would see you in the next one. As always, guys, keep practicing filmmaking. Peace out.